If I told you you could put a zipper in with a serger, would you believe me? I'm gonna show you how to actually make this cute little bag. We use these as what we call our charity gift bags at our store, and people bring us all the travel size soap shampoos, toothbrushes, toothpaste, and then they go into these made zippered bags and then given to some of our local charities. So for the guests, this really gives them something that they can keep and everything stays all together. So this actually only takes four seams. So as we take a piece of fabric, this bag size actually is a nice size. It's, a, it's 10 by 16. And we do have a full video we'll link to here and right there. And also a link in the description that you can go over and watch uh, more about what I do here. But I'm gonna show you how to make this. So first off, start with an extra long zipper. These are nylon zippers, not metal teeth, that are uh, 14 inches long. So that's the 10 inch side. So we'll just line that up right sides together. And you'll kind of just angle in on the top edge. Now, there's some bumps on the front of the foot. You wanna line those so that your needles are actually traveling beside the teeth. So you don't want them actually in the zipper teeth and you want to catch just enough so it holds every, the bag together. So you're probably trimming off just a little bit, that's the zipper itself, just a hair of the zipper. And then, there we go. If you want, double check that you have not gotten too close to the zipper by opening it and closing it one time. Then you're gonna take the fabric and the zipper and repeat on the opposite side. So just line up the edges, flatten this out, and stitch again. So I usually, like I said, just kind of angle on at the top edge. This is some home deck fabric that we actually got donated from one of our local uh, furniture uh, sewing companies. And so it actually makes for a great weight for these bags. Now after two seams, you do need to do the most important part is to unzip the zipper into the middle. Now to get that nice little cute top edge, you're gonna roll the top down, oh, between an inch, maybe even two inches, and then I'm gonna just push the zippers together here, kind of open them up and push them together as we go to stitch. And then you're gonna sew both the side seams. If the zippers are overlapped, that's great. If they're, if they're not, that's okay too. The serge seam will hold them together. All right, and then just repeat on the other side. This side, the zipper will be closed. So you just roll right over it there. And usually I don't break a needle, but about every hundredth bag I will break a needle. If you hit that just, just right, I wouldn't worry about it, but it's time for a new needle. I've also been surging a lot of, or doing a lot of serger videos here too. So we'll turn that right side out. Let's just see that I've got another bag. We usually make anywhere between 1,000 to 2,000 um, bags over the course of a time, but isn't that awesome? And now we've got two more made.